What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back. So, just got done testing a little bit uh, with Toxic Weapon. It's really close, but I want to say that uh, elemental statuses and whatnot are applied based on the weapon. Because with the hammer, I was able to poison the tiger in two hits. Whereas, uh, working with my, my little thick weapons, it took like three or four. Um, but these are like ambush attacks, so it's hard to say. Either way, I was doing enough just tiger murdering. Uh, that I ended up getting the last level I needed, so we are going to be working with Blasting Flare still. That's been solid. Uh, we have Toxin Bubbles now, which works really fast. And then I decided since I'm going to use Amplified Damage, I want to test it. And sure enough, I can use Enhanced Defense with it. So I can probably use this to offset the increased damage I would take from this. So it's like running a Carnage Talisman, but with protection, which should be pretty busted. So uh, let's pop open the gate and... Continue. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think I'm gonna be just I'm gonna be just fine with the damage we're putting out right now. Oh god, I just got killed to that thing. I was so excited, I was like, whoa! Getting hard. Revenge accomplished. Right, now let's see how much I'm doing without that buff. Cause I was moly in that thing. So, 86. Poor, 129. That's a lot of damage. I mean, real fast, just to, just 129 divided by 86. Yeah, it's a 50% increase in damage. That's nuts. I figured it was close to that, but it was right on the money. I haven't been using those elixir things at all. I, I just used one. What does it do exactly? Raises morale rank and increased spirit when used. Causes the spirit to slowly decrease over time. Hmm. That'll put me up to a 21 rank. I know, I know, I always end up doing strength build, but it just, just works well. Oh, shit. Oh, God, okay. Yep, we don't use that. Unless we also have stone up. Damn. 
that was sketchy. See, the sad thing is, I, yeah, I beat him, but like, man, I used every trick in the book. I got nothing left. No heals, no, no nothing. No heals, and I'm on the verge of death. Double bad. from the other side. That's what we're trying to do. Come on, Sunjun. In the way. This is something we unlock later. Ruffian Zhao Hong has initiated an invasion. So, NPC invasion kicks off, and I have zero healing. Cool, cool, cool. I'm guessing this is blocked, probably? No, what? Okay. <laughs> I'll take it. Um, was there anything else in metal for me? So, wait, what was I going up to? Seven. Oh yeah, you were 13. Venom Snare is all the way at 40. Um, thorny Ground at 20. Um, someone's thorns. Step on thorns have their reduce movement. I was going up to Earth for this. Hmm. I mean, going up to fifteen in Earth. For Deathly Bog, it would it would make me a thick boy. Do I even need that? I think there's really good fire stuff. Where are my main weapons here? Well, I mean, actually, I'm not even worried about weapon scaling because I'm doing good with all the weapons. Um. Yeah, screw it. Let's take metal up to 20, and we can we can do what I'm assuming is like an AoE sloth. Should work. Just the the poise from that. We're back in one of the betas. We had a, a setup we were running. Or basically, we went uh, poise on the stone armor, and then we combined it with the heal on hit from the uh, the wood tree. So just an earth and wood build, all centric around uh, just weapon usage and buffs. Let's go meet this invader.
seems like we fight each other and everything is... That's weird. It seems, it seems like the incoming and outgoing damage was actually pretty low there. Ooh, hello. They're not better yet, but once I upgrade them... Sudden Tornado, Waving Willow, Spirit Damage to Enemies with Poison, that works perfect. And I don't know what's happening, I just looked over at OBS. It looked like, it looked like I had a frame that skipped. I really, I really hope OBS ain't skipping frames, like that should be impossible. Considering how beefy this PC is. It looked like OBA hang. It looked like my my shit hung for a second, and I don't know why I would do that. Like, shit has me paranoid. So even if I look at performance, yeah, no GPU, CPU performance across the board is is good. There's nothing that should be causing that. I really hope I don't need to like lower down a setting or something. It would honestly be like my worst nightmare is to, like, to go back and after the fact, after recording all of this, it turns out that like right now I'm looking at it and it looks super smooth, but I really hope there's not like, like just like fuckiness interspersed in OBS. That would suck so bad. The series itself had like Weird issues like that. Oh man, that would that would blow. Cause the game's playing smooth, but every now and again I look over and I just catch like a it's a slight frame hang. It's it's weird. I don't know why it would do that. was going to be slick. I said, sit down, sir. This is definitely the boss. And that's the final, you know, bonfire. But we're missing two of the other flags. Where is the other flags? I feel like this was a shorter level, too. Well, I mean, I don't know. I spent a lot of time messing around with the stuff I shouldn't mess around with. Like fighting that bird early on, but... Two flags? I'm missing two whole-ass flags? That doesn't sound right to me. I can tell you right now, one of them has to be over here. It doesn't make sense that... There's a whole door... How, how do I get in here? start of the game it actually uh mode yeah I, i've never seen this in my life on a on a pc game but just in case there's some weird hiccup happening on the recording side we'll put that on it still looks fine can't pan the camera around to see Ooh. 
Stop that. bullied the shit out of me. I don't know, man. I can see it. I don't know how to get there. And to be fair, stuff like this is exactly why we do walkthrough prep. This is why I don't just do, you know, one let's play and then be like, alright, here we go, walkthrough time, because you know, stuff like that. Gotta be like somewhere. It's, it's probably somewhere inside of a building in this, this shitty camp here. So let's just let's run. I don't know if I get anything for. I mean, they're not like Kodamas. It's not like I have to stack them up. As far as I know, the only benefit of, of getting the maw is that my level would be higher. I'm already 24, so. was 24, apparently that dude pops and takes stuff away from you. I'm assuming there's a respec too, so if if this isn't working out and I want to respec off my metal virtue, you can. Either way, let's see. Let's see what level this bad boy is. Another eat the seed. Looks like our first real loss. See what I can do. I'm just beating you down. Rich. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. 
I put the unger in the bunger with my big, big stick with this hammer. I'm gonna get whip, whipping your ass yellow turban. Beat you so hard you look like a Durban. I don't even know. I'm just making up words. This fight ain't over yet. なんとまがまがしい気を。おお、気候。あの気を見ても落ちぬか。義勇兵にしておくにはもったいないな。Oh, give me the tiger. Give me the tiger. Warera Song. Ryu to Seriya u chikara sumai shi. Tora no ichizu. Sono chi ni yadosu wa jidai o kiri hiraku ni taru so. Ano ashiki ki wa izure warera no yukute o habamu de. I haven't even looked at my other guardian spirits since I got them. So, so, don't know any more. She does never. He told you to get him more. So, see some bouncy physics. I know the conocena. He saw the rose. Somebody she does a night. Is she nicked a great? By who's Jade? I'm swearing in woke. Guessing we make our way to the town now. ひとの命運は天に輝く星が示す。世を騒がした高金の乱の首謀者聴覚はその小生とともに消えました。しかし戦乱が続き、大地から死の匂いは消えません。戦乱の元凶となっていたのは死欲に走る高官たち。その元凶を絶つため英雄たちもまた動き出します帰ったのかい交渉老子が心配していたぞお客さんかい珍しいねそんなところごめん急いでるから老子様老子様山にヨーマが現れてね老子が調べに向かったよありがとう老子様が心配だわでも山に行くのなら、しっかり準備しないと。The Hidden Village Keep, I don't know why it keeps switching when I have stuff sorted by. Hmm. Uh, let me check me, my spirits. Battle set. Aid. I'm 
mean, we could try. I, I doubt it. Mostly press that is playing right now, but yeah. So if I save battle set, okay, it's my specific spec, armor, everything. Nice. Uh, decrease HP damage taken, increase spirit recovery, increase spirit gain from attacks, and decrease HP damage taken. Along with lightning, that's stone. By who applies toxin to your weapon, increase ailment accumulation dealt, and spirit gain from attacks. Apply stone damage to your weapon. That's what I currently have, never mind. Strengthen surrounding allies and restore their health. Also revive allies awaiting aid. Fight alongside you for a short duration. Duration is increased when your morale rank is above 10. Um, wood phase, metal phase, consumption is down, spirit damage is up. Negative effect duration on enemies is up. Restore HP and HP. I mean, right now, by who is, is, that's like what is working for my build, I think. We can use that along with toxic bubbles. So, fire, fire, I don't smell the water puts out fire. Um, debating if I want to try and like triple up on statuses. Hmm. I would probably need something like that on Relenting Frost. That's a pretty big. I mean, these are all really big investments. Like you're you're going Frost build if you want that stuff. But Earth is decent. Could go Deathly Bog, or it could get Quake Bound in. Don't know how useful that is. Like how many deflects I have to hit to actually make it work, though. Um, I'm, I don't know if that's a new zone or what, but this seems like the spot to wrap. Let me set this into a level. Oh, wow. 600 off. I bet I can... Get really exactly enough, just in case it's not... I am Metal Man. Actually, so there's some stuff I could. I haven't even considered it, but the curse stuff. There's a curse bolt. Enemies hit will recover from spirit disruption slower. Curse bolt to the front. Enemies hit deal less damage. Enemies hit receive more damage. Increase the accumulation of all status effects. Hmm. I kind of like the sound of this. At least a metal imbued attack that deals damage to enemy and touch it. Those enemies are inflicted with any ailments. They'll be fully cured. They'll take additional damage. So I'm thinking I run that and then by who? And then I run like, you know, fire, earth, and lightning or something. And be like boom, boom, boom with all three elements and then molten calamity thorn and have it do like a nuke. If it does, that'd be cool. Hmm. 20 is not that far away, so let's get this now. And then I'll start working up these. Um, yeah, but let's, let's, let's wrap things up here. We're going to be heading on out from the Hidden Village in the next part, figure out that mountain. And then I'm hoping we get to our hub from there. So stay tuned, and I'll catch y'all soon with more.